Asana, welcome back to my channel. Today I have a pretty basic plan with me video. I don't have anything special lined up for it, but I did want to do this plan with me video because it kind of sets up what's going to be happening over the next month on this channel. And yeah, I guess I'll get into that when I start planning. But the kit I'm going to use today, I think it's a pretty old one. I'm actually going through a lot of old kits right now. I feel like this year, 2019 is me just cleaning up all the kits I've been buying over the last couple years and hopefully by the end of this year I will have no kits left so I feel a little bit more justified in buying some new kits for next year. So yeah, I don't know. I feel like 2019 is the year of decluttering because I've been doing a lot of that in a lot of aspects of my life. So it says, you are the pineapple of my eye, which is so cute. And I wanted, oh, this is from Alley Cat's shop. So I wanted something kind of summery, kind of cute because I am going on a holiday very soon, which is what the month is about. And it is going to be in a summery place. Well, hopefully a warmer place. Melbourne is starting to cool down quite dramatically, so it is getting pretty cold. So yeah, and then we have this. Sorry for the lighting. Ugh, I'm trying to figure out how can I fix this lighting because it is um, really harsh, the light right now. And so even though I have the curtains drawn, I have like I have like two layers of day curtains, like fabric and everything, but it's still really harsh. And so it has these lines and see, I'm just like, I can't even, like I'm putting paper behind to see if I can do it. I can't. So I'm very sorry, but hopefully, um, once we zoom in and start planning, it won't be too much of a big deal, I hope. So let's get right into the plan with me. So this is the week we'll be planning in, and it is the 8th to the 14th. I'm just kind of figuring out how I can do this. Oops, sorry. I keep bumping everything. All right, let's if I zoom you guys in. Is that a little bit better? Oh, it's a little better. I mean, you still have a few shards of light, but for the most part, it is okay. So, I don't think this kit has any date covers because it is a slightly older kit. So, I'm just going to put down the washi strips at the bottom first. And they're quite thin as well. So, I'm just going to make sure I cover the lines. That's probably more my goal. It's just to cover the lines. And I'll put some weather stickers down as well at the top. This past week, the weather has been really up and down. It was like really cold and really hot. And now when I'm looking into next week, it looks like it's going to be pretty cold like 20 15 degrees quite a few showers i don't have anything on next weekend which is good because it's my last weekend before i head off my trip so i do need the time to sort out a lot of things so over the next month i'm actually going on holiday um i'm only going for a couple weeks so it's not even that long my main concern every time i go even just for like a week or something like that is how to manage everything in terms of like the sticker shop um, my youtube channels things like that because it is a very consistent thing i still haven't really decided i've i kind of want to go back and do some travel with me plan with me spreads i know that they aren't super popular um i always notice that when i film those sort of videos the watch on them is pretty meh so i kind of tells me that most people aren't really too interested in watching that but i kind of like filming them because it allows me to kind of document memories of the trip if that makes sense um and it's my way of kind of having the trip documented in my Erin Condren spread. Yeah, the travel with me is I struggle to find a balance between what I want to film and do versus what I think people would actually want to see and watch. I film every single weekend to maintain the channel to get two videos out a week. And that can be quite difficult if I'm traveling because I just don't have the... I first need to plan out a lot of what videos I want to film and have that scheduled for the day. So like Today I'm filming videos, but I knew that yesterday because I was planning that out um, for the day, like my schedule. Ooh, okay, that's completely crooked. So I don't even know if I'm making sense because I've like I can't talk and plan at the same time. You guys know that I feel like I struggle with that quite a bit. Even though I've been doing plan with me for so long, I feel like I, it's something that I'm not quite there yet. It's still a work in progress for me to figure out how to do that better. Yeah, so I think the next month on the channel is going to be a little quieter, which makes me really sad because. Um, I, I, I don't know, I love, to me, uploading videos on the channel is how I see keeping, like, feeding my channel, like, tending to a garden, watering it, looking after it, making sure it grows and everything like that. And so I know that the next couple of weeks, um, are not, are going to be a little slower. I think I'm only going to be able to upload one video a week during the time I'm gone. And then when I come back, I'll be able to go back to my usual scheduling. Those having said that, 
one thing I noticed that every time I travel, I come back and I'm like, oh yeah, I'm going to do all these things. Like, I'm going to go back into filming. It's going to be really active. It takes me a little while to get back onto the horse, if that makes sense. Like, I feel for some reason after coming back from holiday, it's almost like I need two weeks to kind of just sort myself out so I can go back to regular filming again, if that makes sense. Um, and every time I think, oh, that shouldn't be the case because I'm taking an easy holiday, but... Like for Japan, I came back sick. I came back fully ready to start planning and everything like that, but I came back and was sick and I was pretty much out of it for almost a month. And I felt really bad because obviously I have obligations I need to meet as well and things I have to do. So I really felt like I let people down when I fell sick. So hopefully that won't happen. Touch wood for this trip and hopefully I'll be able to come back and start picking up where I left off. I have filmed a couple other videos, not, not ahead of time, but like they were harder videos to film, so I needed a bit of preparing and stuff, and I might schedule those out instead. They're kind of like more stationary focused videos, so that should be pretty... So maybe I'll do that, I don't know. Basically what I'm trying to say is that I'm not really sure what's happening to the channel over the next few weeks, um, and don't be too shocked if things slow down or I'm not uploading as regularly um, things like that so just be prepared for that if you do want to know what I'm getting up to how things are going then be sure to follow me on Instagram on my main Instagram um, account fables and fashion I'll have that link down below hopefully I remember to do that <laughs> but um, yeah I'm thinking that all, like any updates will go through there and yeah just expect a little bit of a slowdown on the channel probably until maybe end of the month I think I'm not sure on the timing yet but probably end of the month things will start to go back to normal and hopefully they'll stay normal for a good while much the whole spread again sorry for the light patches but it is what it is i hope you guys enjoy the video thank you so much for watching this is selena reporting from my room back to you internet mm -hmm.